Uh, hey everyone, my name is Pat Briley. Um, I'm a junior nursing student here at Franciscan uh, from California. And uh, the, this is the story of Threshold. So it started um, over back in like December of, of 2020. Uh, I wanted to kind of capture what it was like to be at home uh, and, 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 you know, feel the presence of the Holy Spirit um, just in your family room with, with your family, with your friends, you know, when it's, it's so late that your eyes are, are heavy and you're falling asleep, but you don't want to go to bed, right? Um, and so I, I <clears throat> it originally started a little bit like this. Then I, I went to Psalm 84 because I remembered, you know, that scripture where it says, "I, I want to dwell in the, the courts of the Lord, the house of the Lord," um, and that's where that's where threshold came from. Um, yeah, and then for a while it was a threshold, 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 your courts. Um, but I, my friends know I love Mark Barlow, and so this, the chorus ended up being kind of inspired by a Mark Barlow song, Kindness. And that, that's, what it, that's what it turned into. Um, and, and the lyrics kind of came together through a couple different late nights of like taking voice memos and sending them to friends and then going back and changing it. And um, yeah, yeah, just doing it over and over again. Um, but the chords, I really love the chords, so I kind of want to break them down. So in the verse, it, it's really simple. It's just like a four, a G chord. I think I'm moving in, in sixths here to the D. And then this is like a D over F sharp. And this voicing, I was very particular with this voicing because it has the melody on top. And so it, I just felt like it, it, it fit more with the, uh, you know, the... Uh, the melody and, the, and the, the changes going together. So it's like, it was, take me there, take me there, take me there, take me there, to the threshold of your chords. And this is a beautiful voicing because you got that tension between the G natural and the, um, no, sorry, D natural and the, and the C sharp. Um, yeah, on that A chord. And then it goes to the, the chorus, which is D. It's really simple. Walk down. And then you make the B minor to a dominant chord, which takes you to the E minor. And then right here, which is uh, an F sharp. It's an F sharp flat 13 with, a, I think, a sharp 9. Yeah, sharp nine in the melody. And then that serves as the dominant chord to go to the B minor seven. Um, and then walk down to the G. The chords of the Lord. And then, the, uh, you know, I love this praise part. Oh. I had uh, my dad actually, who's, he's a great musician, he, but he suggested that I, I change that part, I save it for a different song because it wasn't connected to the, the rest of the song lyrically. And so I was like, you know, maybe he's right. So I went back to the psalm and what I realized was that um, it actually says those who dwell in the house of the Lord will, will praise him forever. And uh, um, I was like, well, that's, I guess that's it, Lord. I'll leave it as it is. Um, and, and so at the end of all of it, I was just kind of a little frustrated that like my beginning wasn't the original idea it wasn't what it was in the end but I, in terms of lyrical content and, and, and all that but what I realized was that in a, <clears throat> in a certain sense um, the, the home you know that, that family room that home life that I was going for in the beginning um, is, is you know essentially the threshold of the courts of our Lord um, yeah and so, so this song you know I just really fell in love with this song and I hope that uh it brings uh, everyone else, all, everyone who's watching, as much joy and as much intimacy with our Lord as it has for, uh, for me. Yeah, thanks for watching.